Thank you for joining us here for the DCI UCS course introduction for the Introducing Cisco Unified Compute Systems course. So what is our target audience here for the course? Folks, if you are provisioning hardware, racking and stacking, cabling server hardware, or from a server administrator perspective, you may want to sit this course. Also, Anybody who's going to be managing network connectivity and VLAN configuration from the servers to the network is also a prime candidate. Likewise, with the system engineers, uh, we're looking at people who are installing operating systems such as VMware, ESXi, Hyper-V, or KVM from Linux. Uh, any operating system, uh, including the hypervisor operating systems. Also, network administrators looking for troubleshooting and maintenance. Uh, for network connectivity issues, and also any storage administrators looking to get a little bit more information on how the UCS system provisions storage and applies storage. Now, for the prereqs for this course, just a generalized knowledge of servers is, is uh, pretty adequate. Uh, we'd like you to have some routing and switching background. Um, storage area network and server virtualization, not as heavy in this course, but it's a very nice thing to have under your belt. The recommended training before we start taking this course is the CCNA, the Cisco Certified Network Administrator course, and the DC Foundations course, or Data Center Foundations course. Both of these courses will give you a generalized understanding of routing and switching and server configuration and data center networking. Now the key driving factors here for this course, what are you looking for? If you're looking to learn about B and C series a server hardware, this course is for you. Also, if you're looking to figure out what a service profile is and why it's so important, this course is for you. We're also going to show you how to navigate the UCS Manager, which is really the brains of the operation here for Unified Compute System. We're also going to gain some knowledge through uh, hands-on practical labs, utilizing data center equipment and software. And also, if you're looking to prepare for either a current or new job role in the data center utilizing UCS, this course is for you. Now some key technologies that we're going to discuss. As I mentioned before, we're going to be talking about the Cisco UCS B and C series server hardware. What's the CPU and memory requirements and capabilities and what's the hardware and hard drive capabilities of the B and C series servers. We'll also be talking about the difference in managing the B and C series servers. With that being said, we're going to get into the Fabric Interconnects and utilizing the UCS Manager for administration of the B and C series servers. But the things that we talk about the most is service profiles and service profile templates. Service profiles for hardware identity that we can move from one server to another, and then the service profile templates that allow us to template one profile and use it many times. We're also going to get into storage allocation for servers, uh, not only just for boot from SAN configurations, if that's what you're looking for, but we also discuss local RAID configurations. And then one of the last things we discuss here is uh, the VLAN and vSAN or the uh, networking and storage networking configurations. Now, as far as related training products, we do provide the next course in this series, the DCCUCS. This course should be taken after the DCI UCS course because it is going to focus more on configuration and troubleshooting, not just an introduction. Some of the other related courses, uh, you may want to take a look at Hyperflex or the application centric infrastructure courses because, again, the UCS system is the platform which ACI and Hyperflex really live on. Uh, likewise, with the UCS director and the UCS director with ACI, you may want to take a look at administering more than just one data center. And then the uh, DC UCS, again, we just want to make sure that uh, this is the second course in your unified compute system uh, courses. The last thing here is the related certifications with our DC core, DC ACI. These two tech or these two courses are really for people who are looking for data center uh, introductions, not just from a data center perspective, but also from an application centric infrastructure perspective. If you're looking for storage, we do have the DCMDS course. And if you're looking for automating your data center with some UCS components, 
we can take a look at the DCA UI course. Thank you very much.